Hello dear kids, welcome to your online classes. We are going to begin our day with the thought that education is the way from darkness to light. So students, this is our duty to educate ourselves and others also. In our English second, today we are going to do a poem and echo in my room. So this poem is to learn by heart. So what you have to do students? Write this poem in your copy and learn it. Okay? So, about this poem, an echo in my room is written by an American writer, Ken Nexby, who writes funny poems for children. This poem is about a small child who finds echo in his room. So, students, first of all, what is an echo? Echo is a sound that bounces back to you when you talk or some say something in a big hall, empty hall. The sound bounces back to you or echo is the repetition of the sound. Okay, now let us read this poem once. There is an echo, echo, echo in my room today. It's an echo that I wish, I wish, I wish it's a problem, it's a problem, for no matter what I do. If I make a sound, a sound, the echo, echo makes it too. When this echo, echo, echo started, started yesterday, I was not amused, was not amused. It's not okay, okay. Now I must be silent, silent. I am afraid, afraid to speak. If I'm talking, uh, if I'm talking, it might last, might last all week. It's annoying, but it seems, it seems. It's hair, it's hair to stay. It's my parrot, it's my parrot. Saying everything I say. So students, here you can see that some words are written repeatedly written. Repeatedly written means they are written once or twice. Means once a boy is saying and the other two times that sound is echoing back to him. So what happens in this poem? We are going to know in this in its explanation. So let us start. First of all, we will read two paragraphs and then understand what this boy wants to say. There is an echo, echo, echo in my room, my room today. It's an echo that I wish, I wish would go away. The boy is saying that there is a sound in his room and he wants that sound or that echo to go away. It's a problem, it's a problem for no matter what I do. If I make a sound, a sound, the echo, echo makes it too. He is saying this is a problem for him that whatever he do or whatever sound he make, the echo repeats it after him. That is why he wants this echo to go away. Okay students? When this echo, echo started, started yesterday, I was not amused, was not amused. It's not okay, okay. He is saying that this echo started yesterday and he was not at all amused. Means he was not at all happy to hear this echo sound and repetition of the same sound in his room. Now I must be silent, silent. I am afraid, afraid to speak. If I am talking, if I am talking, it might last, la might last all week. He is saying that he must be silent in his room or he is afraid to speak because whatever he says, the echo repeats its sound and it comes back to him. And he is saying if he talks, what will happen? That 
sound will last for all week it's annoying but it seems it seems it's here it's here to stay it's my parrot it's my parrot saying everything i say the boy is saying that it is a reason to be annoyed to get annoyed or to get angry that it's here it's here to stay that someone is here to stay and who is that someone it's my parrot it's my parrot saying everything i say now he is uh, it seems to him or he is feeling like there is his parrot who is saying everything after him so students this is all about the explanation of the poem from the beginning to the end what you have noticed students that some words are repeated or written twice or thrice like echo 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 in my room my room today why these words are repeated or written twice or thrice because the first time the boy has said these words and the second or third time the words or the sound came back to him so i hope you must have understood all the things in the poem and is it is very easy to learn it as it is a interest uh, very easy and interesting poem what you have to do students write this poem in your copy in beautiful handwriting as it is to learn by heart poem we will not write its exercises and question answers in our copy so stay at your home stay safe stay healthy all the best